Hello and welcome to St Maddox Church here at La Maddox on the north of the Gower here in Swansea with me Rob Charles, the organist here and also along with uh, St Caddox Church in Sheridan down the road and also at Claridon Church on the other side there. And today in this video I'm going to be officially unveiling my new organ that I purchased recently at the start of August which is to my left hand side there which is another eminent organ. Now I thought it was the Alpha 200 CS2 model, but in fact it is a DCS 300, and there she is in shot. Well, isn't she a beauty? Yep, indeed she is. Now the cost of the project was met by you good people, my viewers, and the community of Flamadoc and beyond in the shape of a Just Given page that I set up earlier this year. And it's a grand total of £3,000, which is absolutely amazing. So many thanks for your donations and support. It's really much appreciated. So what I wanted to do initially was to sort out the previous organ, the Eminent DCS331, as the electronics had packed up. The organ had been here for just over 30 years and was bought with a huge donation by Mary and Morley Suisse, who lived here in Llamadoc, sadly no longer now, as she passed away, to the tune of £20,000 in conjunction with what we used to have at St Caddox down the road. An eminent Alpha 230 which was killed off in the flood there a couple of years ago. So in this instance the church had no money to do anything. So to get us by we played around with Grand Org and a Raspberry Pi computer. Then I brought in my keyboard, then more recently an iPad to play organ apps. Then I had the idea of a fundraising page as I said earlier, but the church didn't listen. Well, they did in the end, and soon got it going. And in about a month, I raised £1,375 for the project using ALUS. But I wanted to have better audio, which would have cost £3,000, which I felt wasn't worth it. So with the money available, I added a subwoofer speaker on the Viscount organ at St Caddox at Cheriton, which I did a video about. So see the link below in the video description for more details. And after a chat with Martin from Eminent about second-hand organs, the rest of the money went to the organ here in Flamadoc, which I'm delighted with. So what I'll do now, I'll bring you in for a brief look around the console. So let's do that. So here's the organ now. Let's have a little closer look at it. That's what we've got in there. And uh, there's your pedal uh, stops there. There's your swell division. And then the great division over there, and obviously there's two manuals and pedals, and that being the uh, swell, that being the great. You've got all your usual uh, pistons there, your, your main general pistons there, and uh, eight pistons in for the swell, eight pistons in for the great, and, and all the usual uh, buttons and couplers and all that and so forth, uh, down there too as well. And then down below there is the pedal board. On the right then is your swell pedal, and on the left then is the great pedal volume. And over there in the corner there are the external speakers. There's one of them there. And down below there is the uh, subwoofer for the bass. Absolutely marvellous. Well, does she love the party? Eh? And this I'm sure will enhance worship here for many years to come. Now just a bit of background history about the organ here in general. When it's 20 years old, they came from a large church in Swindon that used to seat 600 people. And even Liverpool Cathedral Lawrence, Professor Ian Tracy, organist titular, has given many recitals in it. Now the organ does have internal speakers, but they're not connected. That's why, as you've seen earlier in the video, the external speakers, as they make a much better sound. Bearing in mind of 300 watts of power, so Martin had to turn it down a tad. I would have blown the wings out of the church there. <laughs> but may look into the uh, prospect of having the bass stops made louder. So I'll play now four well-known tunes on the organ for your enjoyment. And I'm going to start off with the classic here, Abide in Me, to the tune of Eventide. And I'll play the others as, as I go along there. So uh, here's the video, and hope you enjoy it. And I'll speak to you at the end of the video for a chat. So you enjoy.
So here we are, that's the unveiling of my eminent DCS 300, and I hope you find it interesting and enjoyable. Now then, once again, I'd like to thank you all for donating to my fundraising page, as I said earlier in the video. And your support is very much appreciated. It will allow me to enhance worship here in church and also to entertain you with my videos here as well. And if you ever want to come and see and have a play on the organ here, you'd be very welcome to do so. So do reach out to me on YouTube or in any way, uh, fashion or any way or form there. So let me know there. So looking ahead now at the week at the end of September, I'll be doing a recital on the organ. Not sure what day yet, but I hope to be videoing that too as well. So watch this space. And if you're ever in the area here on a Sunday morning and you want to come to church, then uh, feel free to do so. And you'll be very welcome wherever you are. And we look forward to uh, welcoming you. And I'll leave a link to our website about service times, etc. in the video description down below. There we are. Fantastic. So now I'm going to play out now the Welsh National Anthem, My Hen Well Fina Vai. So thanks for watching, and I'll speak to you soon. Halvau and Tagnebert.